I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. It's a really great honor to be here, to be in this location. How many county seats and things like that can be organized such that we can go out to almost the virtual location where the very first meeting was held, be here on the shores of Clithra Lake, and, and probably have some of the same conversations that were held 150 years ago. So it, it's just a great day. It really started to make sense to have that meeting in the church, and I was so glad that we were able to get it finished, at least close to finished enough so that we could have the meeting in there. But it was, it was great to stand down there and watch the commissioners talk about their business of the, of the month and to feel like it was almost like a commissioners meeting that they would have had back in 1868 um, when the county was just founded. Hey, Michelle. There you go. Without history, we're kind of rudderless. We, we don't have any path, any direction to the future. We need to know where we've been in order to move on into the future. You know, this was actually the, the first permanent settlement in Ottertail County. And so the building behind me, which is Justice 2, was the storehouse for the church. It was built in 1916. We ended up buying it in uh, 2010. So we ended up remodeling it, um, got it going in 2012 and we've had a uh, coffee shop here that my son Justin and his wife Karen run for us, uh, for my wife and I during the summer. It is the beauty and the quietness and the solitude and the activity and things that all come because of our area that make Ottertail County what it is. You know, if you took the lakes away, if you took our natural resources away, we'd look like a lot of other counties in Minnesota. That is not who we are. And so we have to embrace who we are and we have to make sure that those things are maintained for future generations. The woodland, the water, the prairie, the same reasons that people came to settle here for a better life. People continue to come to Ottertail County for the exact same reason, whether it's visiting, whether it's to work, whether it's to live. The reasons really haven't changed that much. They come here because of our uniqueness, and our uniqueness is based on our history.